Hello! In this video, we are going to prove the following theorem. Suppose A, B, and C are sets. Then, A times B and C is equal to A times B and A times C. So really, we're trying to prove that two sets are equal. And to prove that two sets are equal, what we can do is we can show that everything in this set is also in this set. And everything in this set is also in this set. Let's start by showing that everything in this set is also in this set. To do that, let's consider an arbitrary element in this set. Now notice, because this set is a Cartesian product of two sets, that means every element of this set is an ordered pair. So really, let me consider an arbitrary ordered pair of this set. I'll call it x comma y. Okay, so what does it mean for an ordered pair to be an element of a Cartesian product? Well, if you recall, what we have here is that the first coordinate is an element of the first set, and the second coordinate is an element of the second set. So really, we know that x is an element of a, and y is an element of b and c. Now, because y is an element of b and c, we can write that y is an element of b, and also that y is an element of c. And now notice, because x is an element of a, and y is an element of b, we have that the ordered pair x comma y is an element of a times b. And similarly, because x is an element of a and y is an element of c, we can say that the ordered pair x comma y is an element of a times c. Now notice, x comma y is an element of both a times b and a times c. So really, we can now say that x comma y is an element of a times b and a times c. So what we have shown is that we started with an arbitrary element of this set. And we showed that that same element is also an element of this set. Because that element was arbitrary, we now have that everything in this set is also in this set. And so we have shown that everything in this set is also in this set. Now we want to show that everything in this set is also in this set. So again, let's consider an arbitrary element of this set. Now notice everything in this set is also in this set. And this set is a Cartesian product of two sets. So really, every element in this set is an ordered pair. Therefore, every element in this entire set must be an ordered pair. So when we consider an arbitrary element of this set, that element is going to be an ordered pair. So really, I'm going to say my arbitrary element of this set is an ordered pair, say, x comma y. Now, because x comma y is an element of both this set and this set, we can write that x comma y is an element of a times b, and also that x comma y is an element of a times c. Again, what does it mean for an ordered pair to be an element of a Cartesian product? Well, we have that the first coordinate is an element of the first set, and the second coordinate is an element of the second set. So we have that x is an element of a, and y is an element of b. But also notice, x is an element of a, and y is an element of c. So we have that y is an element of c. And now, because y is an element of both b and c, we can write that y is an element of b and c. And now, putting this together, Notice that x is an element of a, and y is an element of b and c. So we can say that the ordered pair x comma y is an element of a times b and c. So what we have shown here is that starting with an arbitrary element of this set, that same element is also an element of this set. And that means that everything in the set is also in this set. And now notice the two things we have shown here. 
we have shown that everything in this set is also in this set, and everything in this set is also in this set. And that allows us to say that the sets are equal. And so this completes the proof. And so yeah, that's pretty much the idea of how you could prove something like this. And so yeah, that's pretty much it for this video.